Good morning, gang. Chris here with the devotional for you to start your day. And today, I want to remind you who you are in Christ Jesus and what that means for your life. You see, we all live in darkness. We all live in sin before we meet Jesus. We struggle each and every single day trying to get to a place that we think is going to satisfy us and fulfill us. But we struggle and we find that the more we try for things of this world, the less full we feel. And then we meet Jesus. And Jesus fills us up inside. And I want to remind you today who you are in Christ Jesus and what He has taken you away from. Today we're going to read from the book of Peter. We're going to read from 1 Peter chapter 2. We're going to start halfway through verse 8 and we're going to read through verse 10. It reads this. They stumble because they disobey the word as they were destined to do. But you are a chosen race, a royal priesthood, a holy nation, a people for his own possession, that you may proclaim the excellencies of him who called you out of darkness into his marvelous light. Once you were not a people, but now you are God's people. Once you had not received mercy, but now you have received mercy. That first part again, they stumble because they disobey the word. That was me, and maybe that's you. But then we're introduced to Jesus, and we hear his word, and he takes us out of that darkness. He calls us his people. We're brothers and sisters of Christ. We're now living in his light. And there's this peace and there's this joy that comes from knowing Jesus. We no longer stumble in the dark. We walk with confidence in the light. Jesus has called on us to share that word. So I would love for us to all pray together now. God, would you give me one person to share your love with today? You see, Jesus has given us this gift and he has called on us to give this gift to others. So I want to encourage you and I want to challenge you with that today. Would you share God's love with just one person today? Would you bring God's light into one person's life today? That's how we maximize every day. God has given us this gift today. So let's maximize every moment. Let's share the love of Jesus to the best of our ability today. I encourage you to pick up your Bible, read it today. Maybe read 1 Peter and learn more about the life God wants you to live now that you have that relationship with Christ. And if you haven't started a relationship with Jesus yet, do that today. Pray and ask Jesus to come into your life so that you can experience the peace and the joy that come from that relationship. I hope that this was helpful. And as always, if I can ever answer any questions about Jesus, go ahead and message me. And if I can help, I always will. Thanks, and I'll talk to you soon.